Hey guys, it's Josh. And of course, join us to CTO. <laughs> As usual. And welcome back to another Carmel Games game video. This time, in the second of three episodes between my Tomb Raider 2 Let's Play and my next Let's Play. We're going to be playing a Carbo Games game called Sherlock Holmes The Tea Shop Murder Mystery. As usual, it is of course developed by Carbo Games. Uh, it can be found on gamesnappy.com, concrete and concrete.com. No. Congregate.com, sorry. And MouseCity.com. Alright, without any further ado, let's get started. As usual, there's the choose your and select your language option. I'm gonna go with English because that's the only one of those I actually speak, so. Jason Bartholomew Jones was here. He told me someone had murdered Mr. T. Mr. T was the owner of the local tea shop. He said he went over there and looked for me. Okay, so this is Sherlock's home. Wow. Didn't even get a chance to look around. Rude. <laughs> Alright. Talk about a dramatic, big musical sting. It's an insurance policy for the tea shop. If the place gets struck by lightning, and or hurricane, and or flood, and or fire, and or alien, then the insurance company will pay one million pounds. Hmm. Well, that's suspicious. Well, so that is a really, really extensive of, uh, insurance policy. Drat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ew. Those boxes contain all sorts of tea blends. I see they have raspberry tea, blueberry tea, lingonberry tea. Well, you get the idea. Okay. Uh, next turn. Ooh, sugar cubes. Really? Ooh, a key. I mean, it's a point and click adventure game. It's probably going to be useful for something. Is 
filled with useful knowledge and notes regarding previous cases. Okay, well that's all we can do here for the time being, I guess. Main Street? Okay, that was, that was pretty funny. I've never actually noticed that had option before, so... Learns me, he knew every day. Alright, uh, the insurance agency, I guess. That's the only place left, really. Hello, I am here to investigate Mr. T's murder. Eek, that voice. It doesn't look that bad, hey lady. Be very clean waste basket then. Uh what happens if we use the duster in the secret area? Sure. Well, that's quite a name. Hello, I am here to 
to investigate Mr. T's murder. So what do I have to do with this? I can't answer any of your questions until I kill the giant cockroach, the titan inside. That cockroach is hurting my business. All right. I have all day to wait. He may have all day, but we don't. How about we speed this up? Have a little bit. Allow me, please. It's a well-known fact that cockroaches are attracted to me. Die, cockroach, die! If it were up to me, I would have killed all of you. It worked. That cockroach will soon be dead. <laughs> Ooh. That was slightly creepy. Alright, I guess now you have the time to answer a few questions regarding Mr. T's murder. Did you say murder? No, I said murder. Well, I don't think I can help you much. I can't blame you. I can't tell you that Miss Isella, Laura Espinosa, my housekeeper, used to work mm. at Mr. T's tea shop. She even put out three fires in the shop, but for some reason, we decided to fire her. That is when I hired her to work in housekeeping. She hated Mr. T ever since and swore to get revenge. Thank you, sir. That's all I need to hear. Oh, wait! I forgot to thank you for your help with the cockpit. Please take this with Okay. Great. There's one thing left to do. Back to the tea shop. We're gonna play that record. That was loud. Ladder. So the curious thing was originally on top of the shelf. Aha. Yes, it all makes sense now. Get this wrong, the and literally all that will happen is that that you'll make a you're wrong and you'll well you make it is is sort of be proven wrong, wrong and then and you, you try again.
I'm not going to show you that because I'm here for the 100% go. It's not the... Oh, alright. Uh... So basically just that. And so literally just that and and the, the innocent suspect's name is removed from the list. You can do that at a maximum of five times. But the correct answer is... Wow. That was something. Um, wow, the voiceover was done, was done by two people. It's actually amazing. Very impressive. But those accents are interesting, definitely. Anyway, that is Sherlock Holmes the T-Shop Murder Mystery. It's honestly one of my more favourite hit games by Carmel Games because I'm a huge I'm a huge fan of Sherlock Holmes and have been for well years. Yeah, I've been a huge fan of Sherlock Holmes for years. I've read through it. A lot of it is the Sherlock Holmes books, so... I don't know, the, the fictional detective is... special to me. The... Hold this one. Ah, Sherlock Holmes will always hold a special place in my heart. And honestly, so will this game. Anyway, as usual, if you've enjoyed the video, a like rating is very much appreciated. Hit the subscribe button down below to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you have already subscribed but you haven't been receiving notifications, then please click the bell icon down below. 
right next to the subscribe button to make sure that you don't miss any notifications in the future. Share the video with your friends if you think they might enjoy my content. Leave a comment down below if you have any thoughts. And my Facebook, Twitter and Discord information is as usual in the description box down below. Alright, with that done, I said, Jonas and, uh, Jonas and I will see you guys next time for another episode. Bit of a Carmo Games game. Until then, Josh and Jonas out.